Yo, 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 guys! Welcome to some RPS! Uh, which is Shadow Priest, Sub Rogue, and the uh, rest of Shamoon. Uh, I'm actually not sure if this rogue is playing Sub or Assassin, because I think he w did some assassination uh, games first, and like this is the second session. Uh, and yeah, this was recorded a while back, but yeah, I just found it on stream, so just wanted to put it out there because it were it was decent decent games i mean nothing really special but uh, they went pretty good i guess we dropped a bit of rating but we also gained it back in the end and i think we actually surpassed uh yeah i think we got to k on to the priest and then he just uh, fk'd so that was kind of meh since I kind of wanted to get to K as well but uh, yeah he just ditched after he got his achievement but whatever that doesn't matter I got it a few a few hours later or some shit uh, this is kind of funny uh, holy priest elemental and arms uh, pretty good pretty good um, they have really high burst if they play with like um, no AOE, just like Earthshock into Execute, pretty much, setups. Uh, big Mortal Strike into damage, into Earthstock stun. That's the goal, I think. Uh, and that's like 6 seconds of you cannot do shit. Or the heals are really, really, really small. I got Hex, whatever, gonna instant trinket because my priest is fucking dead. Oh uh, my god, he actually got that dispersion, I, I thought he's gonna die. Uh, I almost linked, uh, but I knew I ha he had his person, but he could have died because he was pretty low, and then <laughs> we just annihilate the shaman. But yeah, I mean, full silence on the guy. Rogue had damage, Shadow Priest had procs, and all that. So yeah, that shaman just got deleted. I was even talking about the wrong shit, and the guy just disappeared, but whatever. That's RPS for you, man. They can fucking do damage, like real damage. Rogue has damage and Shadow Priest with his void form shit, he has a lot of instants that can kill you in a stun silence. So yeah, watch out boys, RPS is real. I and mean, I think it's more real than RLS, since Warlock got nerfed pretty hard. Triple CC, so much CC, silence and ship, I cannot get it, even if I could've, I couldn't, cause I had this spell on cooldown, so yeah, I'm just gonna let him sit that one and maybe dispel the other, I actually sheared the other ship and maybe gonna dispel this, uh, yeah, he wanted to blink ship me, he fell, but then he actually blink ship me, uh, he got, my shadow priest got kicked I think and he ha is forced to disperse rogue is down as well I mean low because of the f the thing the orb so we they pretty much stacked up I tried to sit on the other side of the pillar but couldn't really sit there because I, I dispelled the VT and then uh, got downstairs and the mage blinked on the tomb and got full shipped but whatever whatever full ship again I do have trinket but I, they don't have any damage like there is no uh, orb there is nothing so uh, there's like baby damage, so I don't think this is trinket worthy. The shaman got uh, sapped. They actually they are actually under pressure right now, and I gonna get get that. He did get the wrist wrist I think I can't get his poly. That sucks. I have like f two more seconds on my dispel, so that that felt bad. I think the the priest could could have died maybe, or at least forced uh, a lot more cooldowns. We're stacked up up, which I don't really agree, but I did totem here so I guess it's fine for for it now oh my god that cap was such a value though no one killed it so feels bad man rogue doesn't have cloak yet but soon I think and he's probably gonna get stunned since I'm still in the shit instantly dispelled it out out of my CC and now my priest is in CC which I cannot get so that's kind of sad I, I mean they they did it pretty well they did poly with uh, I mean right after the um, Shadow Priest silence. They went with uh, polys, and I'm actually trinketing this, and shouldn't have, shouldn't have, because the mage was mind controlled. Uh, my bad, but whatever, whatever. The game is going pretty well for us. I mean, I still have a lot of mana. Rogue cloak is back. Dispersion is back for sure. Uh, 
gonna not get that shit, gonna probably earth shield the priest, yeah I do, fear on the guy, he trinket, he tries to peel, I'm dispelling that shit and the fucking shaman died. This is what happened man, this is what happens, silence and stuns, if you have no trinket, you're dead, like your team has to peel cr like crazy for you. So yeah, a pretty fast game, and uh, that's how it should be actually, because uh, rogues and shadow priests, like this comp, should actually beat spellcliff or double caster in general. Maybe not so much uh, on the shadow priest boomy version, because they do have uh, more pills, like with the clones, and I can't do anything to the clone other than shear and maybe ground it. And if I'm too far away, I cannot ground in it, uh, and again, I cannot shear him, or like I'm CC'd myself. Because they can do like uh, silence goes and into root beams and stuff like that and clones and hexes on you know, so that's that's kind of hard. I think that's a hard comp for this one. But other than that, like warlocks or other shadow priests with not without the bunkins, uh, they should be decently decently easy. And uh, yeah, I mean, all the good stuff actually. Huh, this is a hard game. Mm, maybe hard game. They should train the shadow priest always, and um, I think he would die. I mean, he would be the easiest target. Like rogue has faint, has vanish, has a lot of stuff, you know. And um, I think the survival does less damage with his explosive trap in faint because it's probably considered as AOE. I'm not entirely sure about that. But yeah, they, they have a strong opener, I instantly think it blind. Um, I don't want to sit a full blind and into a full sap into another trap. That, that would not be such a pleasant experience. So I just want to instant think it and keep my, uh, my teammates healthy. And uh, hopefully we'll, uh, we'll be able to get some pressure, which we are. We are getting uh, pain suppression. On uh, the on the hunter and dropping him pretty low, but he still has turtle and his trinket. And cutting the the rogue a bit, he actually look at that shit. He traveled the entire map to get the to get the, the stun, which landed them a trap. But again, he wasted a lot of time, and my priest is pretty pretty okay. Um, so yeah, we're doing quite well right now. I just uh, totem him right there, and the priest. I don't know why he MC the my rogue while their rogue was on the on our rogue. I wanted to get a hex over there. I couldn't land it because I got uh, stunned. But they did get the silence and the hunter died, and we uh, just finished the game. <laughs> that was a pretty easy one as well. Weird. RPS dudes. Let's see now. Maybe a rematch. Maybe the the same guys. We'll see. We'll see. We should win this, this is a fact. We either kill Shadow Priest, we either kill Shaman, we either kill, kill Mage. We can kill any of them. Yeah, checking my 6 stats, Kappa. As a reminder, this was recorded a while back. The season kinda started, but I never actually played that much. Anyways. Okay, starting on a Shadow Priest possibly. Kicking that VT. Doing some lava burst, which actually hit quite nicely. It, it, it would have been cool with if I had a legion, uh, legion uh, concordance proc, would be able to like sky fury and do like 600k even more. Let's see, sky fury. Let's do another lava. I don't. Fuck, God damn it! I don't have lava burst. I can't get a rock, it's bad, he's full sh uh, Nova now, I can't get it. I should get it now, and I don't because it's almost over and whatever. But yeah. It sucks, man, it sucks that this spell cooldown actually. I, l I used to. I, mm -hmm. I have like mixed feelings about the dispels. It was pretty good when you RNG dispelled the right thing uh, before before it had a cooldown. Oh, this is scary. I think he trinketed and uh, cloaked, which was the right call there. He probably would have died. Got just here. He bombed it, so that's that's good. That's good. He silenced my priest. I think he, if he would have silenced me, I would for be forced to trinket that and uh, probably eat the ship. So yeah, kind of kind of scary. It, it worked out. I still have trinket. I got the. Uh, 
poly into hex which means uh, easy trinket because I'm like almost full DR now so the next poly is immune almost it was like one second so yeah that was a value trinket so thank you Sean for hexing me there um, they didn't really have pressure but they had warp coming which they just use it now so that was a good trinket overall um, now we're trying to get some switches I guess they go on the they go on the shadow priest we instantly forced the uh, dispersion mage is going hard he got stunned yeah on the rogue so this is fine this is fine we recovered they are pretty hmm they're stable in stabilizing but I feel like we should have the upper hand soon um, deep I'm not sure if it's the same thing but they played uh, a bit better they didn't uh, drag uh, the rogue that much uh, in the opener and uh, actually they uh, they aren't played but they do have m more CS's on me which is uh, Gucci but yeah they're pretty close to each other so the rogue can like do whatever he wants so that's kind of an issue maybe I can kick that nope I don't have it I did grounded it because kick wasn't available feels bad man uh, and yeah, Rogue is kinda in trouble. I think he has uh, his cloak back, but yeah, we forced uh, we forced block, and he actually got the sap before the blind was over. It was so close. And yeah, they're pretty much in deep shit. If they go shaman now, they would be some pressure because he's off the yards and uh, off stun the yards. So if you go like shaman now, you would probably get CC, but at least uh, you would uh, have the entire the their entire team below have HP and you could switch on whoever you wanted after that anyway full stun on the shaman mind control into almost killing the mage the shadow priest swapped they have link and that's it they don't have any other cooldowns and there we go silence and another block wow really they, he had another block that's poke jump Eh, still, it's like they don't do anything. They hope for a warp and they hope for a kill, but it just doesn't happen. The swap and dispersion was used, so the second block was used for sure. So basically, it's only Link, but he hasn't, he doesn't have a trinket. So that's kind of sucky if he gets like full stun into a blind zone, because blind is coming up soon enough. So we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, we're pretty much trying to push in right now, and the Shadow Priest is gonna get bombed, nobody can get in, no heals are coming in, he tried to ground, he got feared, I'm doing damage as well, dispelling that, and there he is, he goes down. And he still had silence after the fear, remember that, and he is grounding already, so the Shadow Priest was 100% dead, so that was a pretty clean uh, kill. It was kind of like over, all over the place since we went mage, we went shadow priest, we went shaman a bit. But yeah, in the end we do have a lot more control than them uh, since, they're, since they were stacked up. And uh, regardless, they got a few more CSs on me, it didn't matter overall and we pretty much secured the kill. So yeah, this is a fun comp to play. RPS is pretty fun to play. I, I don't really have to do much, just do some damage and some purges while we go for the for the finishing, you know, for the setup y kill thing. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'm gonna try to to stream more on Twitch, so follow that. www.twitchtv.com slash hellpower the same name as this YouTube and hope I'm gonna see you there as well and maybe some lives on YouTube as well I don't know soon bye